Good evening. In Maine, there is said to be a mysterious serpent living within and on the shores of Poco Moonshine Lake. This is the tale of the Poco Moonshine Lake monster, known to locals as Poco. So get comfy and relax as we explore this obscure tale of the strange and supernatural. Poco Moonshine Lake is a small lake in Washington County. It is reportedly the home of a giant serpent ranging from a length of 30 to 60 feet long. The legend of the serpent began with a disagreement between an Algonquin shaman and a Mi'kmaq chieftain. They agreed to meet on the shores of the Poco Moonshine Lake to settle their disagreement. The Algonquin shaman took the form of a giant horned snail while the Mi'kmaq chieftain took the form of a giant serpent. The Algonquin shaman emerged the victor of the battle and tied the body of the Mi'kmaq chieftain still in serpent form to a nearby tree. The only sighting of the serpent was based off a trail that came out of the lake. The trail was measured by Sewell S. Quimby. He estimated the trail to be between 3 and 4 feet wide and 2 and a half to 3 feet deep. The trail was sinuous, making 3 or 4 bends. Quimby attributed the trail to the freezing and thawing of the swamp. Quimby was prompted to investigate the trail while overhearing a man talking about another man's encounter with the giant snake. Apparently, the men were planning on going out to the lake to hunt the monster. Quimby would later write the local newspaper refuting the claims of the men who had claimed to see the monster. Another, Manly Hardy, would attribute the sightings to that of otters swimming together with one in the lead and the others following. So what do you think? Is there a giant serpent lurking in Poco Moonshine Lake? Or is it all a case of mistaken identity? Leave your comments below and let me know what you think. That concludes this week's Obscure Tales of the Strange and Supernatural. Before I end this video, I just wanted to take a moment to apologize for not posting for so long. Life gets in the way as everyone knows and sometimes you have to put things on hold and take care of what's going on in your life. I have gotten back to work on video making though and I am also working on videos for my second channel, Sacred Crown Healing. So if you're interested in healing through spiritual awakening, you can check that channel out. I will start leaving links once I have my uh, new videos up on that channel because I've done a whole rework of that. I also have some new things planned for this channel as well, so stay tuned for that. And as always, thank you for watching. I appreciate your support so very much and stay tuned for new obscure tales of the strange and supernatural. I will be back to posting them every Friday night.